Welcome ladies and gentlemen, Gorhamian here with Misfit Studios as always, and today we're going to be showing you how to clone in HitFilm Express. That way you can have yourself or multiple assets in the same scene. Okay, so cloning yourself in HitFilm Express is actually fairly easy. What you want to do is you want to put in your um, footage into your timeline, just like this. Um, what this is going to do is to do that second video um what this is going to do is going to allow you to line up your audio that way you can see you know the cues a little bit better and what i do is i just add um them on top of one another we've got these two different um clips we actually want to put those together there's overlapping right now it's just like the layers and a composite shot on your editor anything on the top or above your video so video two will show up before video one because it's on the top if we move this away as you can see that slider it will be um, the second video underneath. It's layered just like it is in the composite shot. So what we want to do now is we actually want to line the, the two audio waves up because what that's going to do is it's going to give us a visual representation on when one clip um, is done and when the next one begins. Not necessarily time-wise. Both clips are going to be the same length of time, but you want to be um, you don't want to be talking over yourself or you don't want your assets or your actors to be talking over one another. So let's go ahead and we're going to bring in the first clip all the way. And it looks like um, the intro here, you can see the sound wave is when I'm talking on the right side. So let's go ahead and turn that video off. And we're going to drag this over to the end. At the end of it, I'm actually going to be turning to my right or on camera, it'll be turning left to look at the other asset or look at myself on the other side of the screen because we're actually talking, you know, not necessarily back and forth, but I'm allowing the other version of me to talk while I'm not. So let's go ahead and play through this just a little bit. That way we kind of get a sense of what it Welcome, is. Welcome ladies and gentlemen, Gorhamian here with Misfit Studios as always. And today we're going to be showing you how to clone and hit film express. And see, I look over to the left, to the left of the camera. Okay. Um, and what that's doing is, is I'm looking at the other actor, the, you know, in this case, it's going to be myself, um, in the scene. So what we want to do is we actually want to drag this, um, we're going to go ahead and cut just a little bit off of this because if we turn this back on, we can see I'm looking at the camera. All right. We want to get to the point to where I turn and am facing the camera. So what we're going to do is we're going to actually highlight this and we want to drag this um, first clip to the left. And what that's going to do is it's going to move the beginning of this off a little bit. So we're actually going to shrink this down to about there and then move that over. We're going to keep cheating it over just a little bit. And now what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and turn, mute the audio just a little bit because I want to make sure that we're getting about the right timing. All right, that, that's okay. The problem being, though, is this clip disappears. So what we're going to do now is we're actually going to extend this back to the beginning that way both clips are playing at the same time so let's go ahead and trim off the end of this one because we want both of these clips to be the same length so now what we want to do is we actually want to apply a mask okay so let's turn this video off and we're actually going to start it right there so let's go ahead and trim both videos at the beginning that way we don't have you know the uh beginning of those. We're going to highlight all both clips and drag everything to the front. We're going to do the exact same thing on the back. I'm going to turn this one back on so we can see it. <clears throat> that way we don't have any extra um, footage in the beginning or the end. That way everything, you know, runs smoothly when you put it into the rest of your video. So let's go ahead and clip both of those right there. There we go. Now that we've got our um, trimmed clips and everything is in the right time frame or that the, the timing is correct let's go ahead and apply our masks so we're gonna go to the first video okay which is gonna be actually the second video in sequence if that makes any sense because I've got it you know above um, the footage on you know the intro the intro part of the footage is on the second layer so you're not gonna be able to see that so what we want to do is we actually want to apply a mask around this character now it gets a little bit more complicated if you are um, interacting, like if you're going to be throwing a ball to, you know, yourself or, you know, the, the clone in the video is going to be throwing a ball. 
um, or interacting physically with that, the masks get a little bit more complicated. But for this, it's just going to be a simple um, simple mask on it. So we're actually going to go and click our mask. Um, it's just going to be the square mask tool, and we're going to mask that just like that. What that's going to do is it's going to um, hide that mask. You know, everything around that will show up. Now that we've got both of our assets in, we're going to go back to the selection tool, back to the beginning, and let's play this through one more time and see how the... Um, how the mask is set, how the timing is, that kind of thing. I turned off the audio. Let's go ahead and turn the audio back on and go through that again. This is just the intro, of course, to this video. We're just showing you how to make that. So let's go ahead and see how it looks. Welcome, ladies and gentlemen. Gorhamian here with Misfit Studios, as always. And today, we're going to be showing you how to clone in HitFilm Express. That way, you can have yourself or multiple assets in the same scene. Perfect. It sounds really good. It looks really good. The transition between the one character and another looks great. Let's go ahead and export this. We can, um, you know, add any lighting or any visual effects that you want. If you've got any tracking, you can, you know, put that down too. So let's go ahead and export it out. We can see what the finished product looks like. All right. Now that we've got it exported, let's go ahead and um, take a look at how the timing and everything is now that it's nice and smooth and exported. Welcome, ladies and gentlemen. Gorhamian here with Misfit Studios, as always. And today, we're going to be showing you how to clone in HitFilm Express. That way, you can have yourself or multiple assets in the same scene. Perfect. Welcome. It looks great. The timing is awesome. Thank you, ladies and gentlemen, for watching. And please, don't forget to hit that subscribe button. If you want to see anything else done in HitFilm Express, please leave a comment down below, and we will see you guys next time.